Hey everybody, David from Living Tech here. Believe it or not, we have a power outage right now, but we have a, a whole house generator, which is why you see the lights on in the background. So it's a 20 kilowatt generator, and I wanted to know charging at 72 amps, what kind of impact that has on the generator. Uh, we don't really have too much more going on in the house electrically, so uh, I think it should be okay, but I thought it was worth the test. So here we go. So that's the sound of the generator you hear. And here we go, we'll plug this in. So what I want to do, it's on schedule right now. I'm gonna turn down the charging current so we can, uh, I guess it's gotta boot the screen, hang on. Okay, so this is the charging screen, of course. Uh, see, I have it uh, scheduled for that. I'm going to turn the charging current way down just to see how the generator responds. I'm going to take off schedule charging and that should kick on the charging right now. See, starting to charge. Okay, so I can hear it now. Um, he, I can hear the generator on. I'm going to increase the current. Currently it's charging at, well, 20 amps, right? 31. Let's say 48 amps. So it's slowly going up. So now it's steady state. By the way, this is a Generac Guardian Series 20 kilowatt whole house generator with auto switch over. 62 amps. So we're at 68, 72 is the max. Now we're up to 72. It's actually charging at 72. So that's interesting. There is no problem whatsoever uh, with this generator at this point. Go outside and have a look too.